And so every year around E3, Sony does this days of play week or week and a half where they have these, these good sales on games and consoles and PlayStation Plus and all that sort of thing. And at least the last two years, they've been coming out with a special edition PS4. Um, so last year in 2018, they had a days of play PS4. And this year they have another Days of Play PS4. And this year it's kind of like a gray console. I'm not sure if they have a specific name for the color, um, but it kind of looks like the same grayish type of color as the Batman PS4 that came out probably four or five years ago now. Uh, so basically I'm gonna unbox it and we're gonna see what it looks like inside. So you can see here on the front, as I said, it's a gray console, um, pretty straightforward. I'm excited to open it up and see what it looks like because I actually have never opened up a PS4 Slim. Um, but you can see on the side it says, basically the same thing days of play and on the back just kind of their advertisement best place to play shows that they got PS Plus PlayStation View and PlayStation VR and it shows some games they got tells you what comes with it so you got PS4 console DualShock 4 controller uh, headset HDMI cable power cord USB cable and printed materials so if you look at the top here pretty much the same thing um, got our piece of security tape here and we're gonna go ahead and open it up so pretty much every PS4 console that I've seen from Sony they have kind of like an outside outer box kind of skin thing and then a white box on the inside so here's the inner box as I said it's usually a white box I think it always is a white box actually and I believe you can open it up from the side all right so now I've got to open it on the side and kind of get a peek into there and see what's in here so I'll take the first few things out and we'll take a look at them all right so all the standard stuff uh, like your USB cable AC power cable HDMI cable, headset, and the controller. So this is actually a really nice looking controller. It's definitely a matte gray sort of color. I'm not really sure how else to describe it, but you can see the color in the video. And just as a comparison, this is the gunmetal gray controller I have from the Batman PS4 limited edition console from years ago. Um, this one is also gray, but it's a little bit darker but it's really nice looking. So now what we really want to see is the console. So it kind of move this flap out of the way and then it should just slide out. So here's the actual console. As you can see, we got our quick start guide, all of our manuals and everything. All the stuff that comes sealed in this bag and stays sealed because nobody actually looks at it. And your console kind of comes in this, these little cardboard uh, inserts that hold it in there and protect it. So now to the good stuff. Basically, you just gotta take this um, plastic wrap or whatever you want to call it off of it and we will see what we got inside Ooh, that's a that's a pretty nice looking console all right guys so you can you can see that there uh, so on the top you kind of got like this I'm not sure if you can consider that embossed or what but basically kind of like a shiny metal looking triangle circle X and square um, and then the rest of your console is like a matte gray kind of just like the controller and as you can see with the lights it gives you a nice a nice shine um, and it's something that's not going to get fingerprints on it just because of it's a matte gray um, And it's that's a nice looking console. I'm not gonna lie. So if you take a look at the front here um, As I said, it's a PS4 slim So it's kind of got the the two the two levels to it the thick one on the bottom and the top one That's a little bit thinner and you got your disc slot You got two USB ports over here, and you got your power on and eject button And the rest of it's pretty straightforward uh, put your hard drive in the side and then on the back you got all your vents, um, your AC power, your auxiliary port, HDMI, and your LAN port. But yeah guys, this is a really nice looking console. I'm going to give you guys another quick look at it. That's just, that's really nice. I really wish this came in a PS4 Pro. I would definitely get this and I would use this as my daily console. Unfortunately, this is a PS4 Slim, so it doesn't have the power of the PS4 Pro. And so therefore, I probably won't really use it for daily gaming. But it's still a pretty sweet console and I'm definitely glad I got it. So if you guys are looking to pick up a PS4 Slim, I definitely recommend getting this one. It's $300 plus tax from, I think you can get it from Amazon, Best Buy, and Target. I'll definitely put a link in the description if you want to go buy it. And I'll definitely put some more links in the description for the sales that uh, Sony has going on for Days of Play. I think you can actually get PS Plus for $20 off. And some other games are on sale like Spider-Man and that sort of thing. Uh, but I'll put some more links in the description. But thanks for watching guys and hope you have a great day.